what's going on guys welcome back today's video we're going to talk about things that can affect your hash rate from your computer now some of these will be no-brainers we'll go over the no-brainers really quick in the beginning but others others are a little bit sneaky specifically this one that kind of surprised me uh, but we're going to talk about this like i said and so Hit the thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys are new. Let me know down in the comment section if you've noticed any specific things that affect your hash rate when mining. And this this video is more towards those people who, not the mining farms, but the, the people who use their computers, their gaming computers and whatnot to be able to mine. So let me know if you've seen anything that affects your hash rate. Drop it down in the comment section. And uh, let's start the video. We're going to start off by just naming off the things that are kind of duh moments. So first things first, gaming obviously reduces hash rate. That is that is a given. We know that if you're gaming and mining at the same time, you're not really going to be getting full hash rate on mining. And you're probably not going to be getting good experience while gaming. That's a given. Next. OBS, if you are a video streamer or, or gamer streamer, uh, if you record videos for YouTube or whatever, obviously OBS is going to affect your mining. It's going to give you a bad hash rate. It's going to tank it usually more than half. Uh, and it will affect your recording of videos at the same time. Obviously, that is a given. But now we're going to start getting to the little bit more obscure ones that affect your hash rate all right next up is drivers so whenever a new game releases nvidia puts out a new driver like there's more updates for nvidia drivers than these miners can keep up with they're not going to go ahead and put out a new miner every time there's a new driver update drivers can have an effect on your gpu mining so with that in mind, maybe unless you're, you know, there's a game that released that you just bought, for example, right? So let's say Horizon Forbidden West released on PC and there's a driver update for Horizon Forbidden West. Well, if you're a gamer streamer and all that, you're probably going to update your driver so you can have the best gaming experience as possible. That will or could potentially have an effect on your hash rate since the miners won't be updated to that latest driver or to be able to work properly on those latest drivers so you may see a dip in hash rate for that driver update another one is steam having steam open can affect your hash rate does it do it all the time no like for example if i open steam right now it won't affect my hash rate all the time it depends on what section of Steam you're on. And that's why it, it that's why I say it comes down to kind of an obscure one. Because there's sections of Steam that do use your GPU and there's others that do not. So the sections that do not use your GPU, that, uh, that won't affect your hash rate. But the ones that do, well, then you'll see your hash rate start dipping. I don't know which sections of Steam affect hash rate and which ones don't because i don't know which ones use your gpu and which ones don't uh the store page i believe does use more gpu processing than your library page does your community tab should also uh use more gpu power because they're on the community tab there can be videos okay so videos any sort of videos will affect hash rate another going uh, another segue from that is watching videos okay so watching videos duh obviously will use some gpu processing power if you're watching videos on hulu if you're watching videos on netflix uh youtube or if you're watching more even more so if you're watching videos directly from your computer like using vlc player or windows media player anything like that that is going to use gpu processing power that is going to affect your hash rate uh, watching videos on youtube doesn't do it so much it does it a little bit but it's so minor that it you won't really even notice it. You won't pay attention to it. It's like point something of your hash rate. It's not going to drop it like, uh, you know, from, say, 
35 down to 30. You're not going to see that happen. You might see like 35. So if you're mining like anywhere between 35.65 or, uh, you know, 35.95, you might see it drop down to maybe 35.20. You know, like it's not a huge deal, but you'll see that be affecting it. Another big one is Chrome. Chrome is a huge one. Uh, because Chrome can use GPU processing power just in general, okay? We all know that Chrome eats up a lot of memory, but depending on the websites that you have open and depending on the settings that you have on Chrome, it can drastically have an effect on your hash rate. So, for example, on my own personal Chrome, I have uh, hardware acceleration turned on off hardware acceleration turning on will affect your gpu processing power um, also apps running in the background when google chrome is closed can have an effect on your gpu processing power so be aware of things like that another one is xbox game bar so if you've been playing games and xbox game bar for whatever reason stays on that will affect your GPU processing power and will affect your hash rate. The reason why is because it acts as if you're still playing a game. So if you don't have that turned off, or if you have it where it stays on, make sure that it turns off whatever settings, whatever buttons you have to push to turn it off, turn it off. The next one we get to is Photoshop. Photoshop is kind of a given, but also kind of not. Like for example, I have Photoshop running all the time, but that doesn't necessarily mean it's affecting my hash rate. The, the way that it affects your hash rate is if you have it open, okay? So what does that mean? Well, I have Photoshop running all the time, but I don't have it full screened all the time. If I have it full screened all the time, then that will affect my hash rate because at that point it is using my GPU to process things. If I'm moving images around, if I'm working on a thumbnail, anything like that, that will take GPU processing power. If I have it minimized, it acts as if it's closed. It is not using any GPU processing power, and that's fine. That's okay. So say if you were working on a thumbnail and you didn't want to exit it just yet because you're not done with it. You saved it, but you're not done with it. Minimize it. You're good to go. It's fine. It won't affect your hash rate at that point. But if you have it open, it could have an effect on your hash rate, especially if you're working on the thumbnail itself. Next up is video editing. Obviously, that that's kind of should have been in the obvious ones, but I kind of forgot about it. Video editing will have a drastic effect on your hash rate. If you're editing, might as well turn off your mining because it just it won't go. It's almost as if you're playing a game or recording a video because at that point, you're watching videos. It's using your GPU to render videos, to render the preview videos, to, uh, to move and edit everything that you're doing so yes having your uh having your editing software whatever you're using sony vegas adobe premiere hit film doesn't matter it will all affect your hash rate now here's probably the most obscure one for me that i've noticed and i didn't notice it right away this one here is one you don't really think about because you kind of just have it open all the time and that's discord discord has a big effect on mining and i didn't even realize this and i don't know why so having discord open this is the same it's the same thing that uh that happens with photoshop like you can have discord open but minimize it so if you have discord open and it's full screened it uses up a, a good amount of your GPU processing power, enough so that it affects it and drops it a few mega hash on your mining. So, for example, on my 3060, if I'm mining and I have Discord open, it'll take it from 36 down to 32. A good four hash rate lower. It's... And, and that's even if, if I'm on a section that nobody's typing or there's no uh, no GIFs that are playing or GIFs, however you want to say it, uh, if, even if, if there's nothing playing. But it uses your GPU 3D 
uh, engine, which is very weird, and I don't know why. So, for example, when I'm recording stuff on OBS, this uses my video encoder, and that's why it's using up my GPU processing power. But Discord, Discord uses up your 3D encoder, which affects your processing power and, and affects your hash rate. So that one is probably the most obscure one that I, I don't know why it's, it's doing that. I don't know what it's rendering in 3D to be able to use it. Maybe it's just the, the way that the system is designed for, for Discord. Maybe it's just the, uh, the, the GUI on, on it. Um, you know, like I, I, I'm not entirely sure. If you guys know, let me know down in the comment section because this one's a stump. A stumper for me because I have no idea really don't but you can have discord open just minimize it to your tray and it won't affect your hash rate at that point it's no longer using any processing it's not doing anything it acts like it's closed uh, when you have it minimized to your tray so those are the ones those are the big ones that I've seen that can affect your GPU hash rate um, there's other things you can do too, like setting your system to high performance mode instead of power saver, because if you're setting it to power saver, obviously you're not going to be getting the proper power to your GPUs in order to, uh, to mine. Uh, that's, that's kind of like another given one, but, uh, just little things that you can do. But those are the ones that I found that have a, a significant impact on your, your mining and kind of a weird obscure one that that discord one kind of bothers me a little bit like i just don't know why it's doing that um again if you guys can figure that one out please let me know down in the comment section with that hit the thumbs up subscribe if you guys are new thank you so much for watching today i appreciate all of you guys more information you guys share with me is more information that you guys share with each other so don't forget to leave a comment and i will see you guys next time everybody happy mining